वेलकम टू माय चैनल स्टेनोग्राफी इंग्लिश एंड मराठी हेयर वी विल सी ऑल अबाउट इंग्लिश एंड मराठी स्टेनो बट बिफोर दैट प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माय चैनल आवर जनरल व्यू इन रिगार्ड टू वेस्ट एशिया हैज बीन फ्रीक्वेंटली स्टेटेड आवर एप्रोच is not inimical to any country there it is friendly to all countries but inevitably our sympathies are with the arab countries and with arab nationalism which represents today the urge of the people also according to our general policy as well as our views on the present situation in west asia we do not accept that foreign troops should be used in any territory in the area in the circumstances prevailing there we are too convinced that there can be no settlement and no return to normality till foreign troops are removed from the area sometimes it is stated that these countries should be treated like tender infants and be under the guardianship of bigger countries but it is quite clear that they do not like this offer of guardianship and patronage and in fact recent such suggestions one has to take to some extent a historical view of the development in west asia for hundreds of years these countries in west asia were under turkish domination they came out of it the end of the first world war the western powers decided what they liked about these countries without really caring much for the wishes of the people probably there was no organized way for the people to express their view new nations were created and the contacts of the western powers were with the rulers of their own creation or cheaply with the landed gentry there were few contacts with the people the whole period between the two world wars was one when arab nationalism was trying to push out this foreign domination and was gradually making some progress in that direction then came the war and the post war period when much has happened in the various countries of middle east the major fact in west asia is the growth of arab nationalism in a very powerful resurgent way egypt took the lead in this matter and under the wise leadership of president nasser has played a very important part nasir in fact become the most prominent symbol of arab nationalism this fact which was patent was neither liked nor appreciated by many powers and an attempt was made to split the arab countries in fact arab nationalism 
this should not be allowed to happen in the interest of global peace